Just like modern sperm whales, this Miocene monster had its own built-in echolocation system, which allowed it to detect prey from as far away as one to one and a quarter miles. Leviathan's echolocation relied on a massive organ called the spermaceti organ, which was filled with oil and located in its head. We don't know what kind of good karma sperm whales built up to deserve it, but this incredible organ seems to be a special gift from nature given only to them. This organ sits in the whale's head and can make up as much as 35% of the head's total weight. Thanks to this oil-filled structure, Leviathan could emit sound waves in a specific direction and pick up the echoes that bounced back. In addition to echolocation, sperm whales use this oil organ to dive incredibly deep, up to around 1.2 miles, and stay down for long periods of time. To maintain natural buoyancy at a certain depth, all they have to do is change the temperature of the oil by just about 5 degrees Fahrenheit. When the whale needs more buoyancy, it increases blood flow to warm the oil inside the organ. But when it dives, that blood flow decreases, the oil cools down and the whale's body becomes denser, allowing it to sink with ease. It's such an elegant system that even modern submarines could envy how efficiently it works. The spermaceti organ has another job too. It acts like a shock absorber during headbutting collisions. This feature comes in especially handy for adult males. That's because during mating season, males often battle one another by smashing their massive heads together in brutal contests for dominance.